I'm calling this brand new teardrop trailer innovation on wheels. In this video, we're gonna tour the little guy's shadow so you can see the unique features this teardrop trailer has that adds comfort and functionality into this compact space. This trailer is made by Extreme Outdoors, the same company that makes the little guy Max the teardrop trailer I've owned for the past five years. So I think I have a special insider point of view on this new teardrop trailer. Let's first start with a quick walk around of the outside because there are a couple of things I wanna point out. And next we'll look at the outdoor kitchen or the galley. Then we'll head inside where in my opinion is the most innovative design transformation. Okay, it has an outdoor shower, which this has come in really handy. There's also a TV rack so you can take the TV from inside and place it on this rack and watch TV outside. My little guy Max also has this and gosh, in over five years, I've never used it once. Let me know if you think this is something that you'd use. The door stopper that came on my trailer and never worked. So years ago, I replaced it with this same magnetic door stopper. It's been perfect for catching and holding the door, especially on windy days. These diamond plated fenders look really sharp, but they're perfect for accessing the rooftop rack. So you can bring along kayaks or electric bikes with you. The last thing on the exterior that I wanted to point out is the diamond plated storage box for the propane tank and the battery. Mine came with a plastic one. So this is a really nice upgrade. Okay, on to the galley. One thing I wanna mention is that while I was playing around and testing everything on this little guy shadow, is I could feel the quality. It looks like it's built with the same construction and a lot of the same products that my trailer was built with. I do a lot of camping, so it's been to a lot of places and even some places I probably should never have brought it to. And it's held up really well. Look at all the counter space that is in the small kitchen area. This is the same cabinetry that's in my teardrop trailer and I absolutely love it. And of course you can never have too many cubbies or places to store our stuff. So I'm really impressed with all of the storage space this kitchen has for being such a small camper. These are deep drawers, so you can store a lot of kitchen supplies in here. And to keep your food cold, it comes with a 40 quart ice chest cooler. Okay, now let's check out the interior of the little guy shadow. The first thing you'll notice is this teardrop trailer has a sitting area with tables. This is unique for teardrops this size because most just offer a bed or sleeping area. And for more functionality, there are two tables and they swivel. I think this is innovative because I often wondered if it would be awkward or uncomfortable to eat play a game of cards, or do some work if there was only a bed area. Okay, let's go on inside so I can show you more features, and then I'll show you how to convert the sitting, dinette, and couch space into a bed. The first thing I wanted to point out is I'm five feet, two inches, and I still have some space here above my head to sit comfortably. If you've watched some of my other small camper tour videos, you know that I believe windows are a small camper's best friend. They make tiny spaces feel more spacious so you don't have that closed in feeling. These are the same dual pane windows that are in my little guy Max and I love them. They do a really good job at keeping the cold and the heat out. Plus people walking by can't see inside unless you have lights on. And this is your view when you're sitting behind a table. I was actually surprised at just how comfortable it was sitting in this small space. And that's because of this next feature that they added, and that's a drop floor. It provides extra room for your legs and additional storage. Now let's convert the space into the bed area. And to do that first, you remove the tables. Oh, but first, real quick, let me show you the additional space that's underneath these boards. I like that they use this real quality wood throughout the trailer. Okay, now let's transform the space into a sleeping area. And to do that, we just place the tables on top of the drop floor. And then the cushions are tri-folded, so you just unfold them. And voila, you've got enough space for two people and a dog 
because this space is 64 inches by 80 inches, which is just a little bit bigger than a regular sized queen size bed. Some of the highlights on the backside wall are a Bluetooth radio, a TV, an air conditioner, a cool table that slides out, and more storage space. On the front side, you've got more storage space, two charging stations, and cup holders. As simple as cup holders are, I think they're brilliant because using them is gonna help prevent things from spilling inside your trailer. Before you end watching this video, will you please hit the subscribe button for me? It would mean the world to me and I appreciate you. Also on the screen right now are more exciting small camper tour videos that I think you'd enjoy watching next. So click on them now. Well, that's a wrap and I can't wait to see you again next Thursday.